Hello, I'm James Parkey, and welcome to Living Life, David Eastdale. And in this video, I'm in Liverpool. Well, I got here yesterday. But I'm, I'm staying here for a couple of days, and just for, to get away a little bit, and because it's somewhere I really want to go to. I went a few, here a few years ago for a day trip, but now I'm here for a couple of days. So, I got in mid afternoon yesterday and you decided to explore a little bit around the pool for the evening. So this is what I ended up doing. After I got sorted in the hotel, we took a stroll towards the Bull City Centre. So we passed a lot of buildings around the Liverpool University and also we passed the cathedral, one of the cathedrals in Liverpool. The road down to the centre was about a mile and it was actually quite a slope and quite a gradient but it didn't help the fact that I forgot my coat and, and it was a bit cold but in the distance was St John's Beacon which is what we were heading towards. St John's Beacon is about 400 foot high and it's got views all around Liverpool and it was built in 1970 and it had a revolving restaurant on it but that was shut in 1978 and then it was left derelict for about 20 years until it was like restored and in the morning the, the local radio station broadcast between 6 and 10 but for like a few pounds you're able to go up there and basically have a look around the pool. For example, the Royal Albert Dock is in front of you. And the River Mersey and the Lima Building are all within distance. And on a clear day, you can sometimes see Snowdonia which is the highest mountain in Wales. I was really pleased that I was able to come up here and say well worth the long drive down to get there. We had a walk up Matthew Street and it was full of live music. So it was at my kind of street. And right next to the statue of Sil Black is the Cavern Club, which is where I was heading. This is the main room in the cavern and it is quite tiny because the stage is quite small but it certainly was a really good atmosphere. Please don't leave me, please don't leave me 
throughout the Cowling Club is evidence and memorabilia of people who have played at the club through the years. It's finding a variety of different genres and it certainly shows how important the club is in the music industry of Liverpool and beyond. I was really pleased I had the chance to go in here. Well that was really good and I didn't expect to be going into the, the cabin club because the last thing I knew was that the, they were having problems with the lifts because the area has been some building work so to be able to get down into the cabin was yeah, excellent, you know, really enjoyed, like, going out as a bonus. And St John's at Viewing Point, at the top of the radio tower, yeah, that, that was excellent, you know, to be able to see around Liverpool from, like, 400 feet high. That was really good, I really pleased that I went there. And those. Those two things were a bit of a spur of the moment things because I wasn't really sure what time I'd actually get, get here yesterday. So I'm really pleased and it's a good start to the trip. So thanks everyone for watching. No, no, no. I'll see you on the next one.